In this video, I'm going to walk you through step two in the download and installation process. And we start at mt4.quantumtrading.com. Head on up to the support page here. And from the drop down menu, click on the lifetime license installation. Now, step one we've already covered, which was creating our quantum trading account. So we're going to scroll down here. This is all explained down to step two. And here we are. And here you can see the download link to download your indicators. Just click on that. This will start the process. And at the bottom there, you can see that we have downloaded something called the QTI-full.zip. Now this is a zip file. In other words, it's zipped with all the files included in a folder that you now need to extract from that download. And I'm going to show you how to do that and then copy and paste over into your MT4 account. If I left click here and left click show in folder, here you can see the download that we've just downloaded and the reason there's the little six in brackets is because I've downloaded this before but if this is a fresh installation for you a fresh download it should just say QTI hyphen full as here and you can see the little zip icon we have to extract this and to do that we right click and if we scroll up here to the pop-up menu you can see it says open with and we are going to extract this using Windows Explorer, which is very easy. We're just going to click the OK. And this is what we want to see. Our MQL for folder. This is the one we want. You can see up here where we've actually extracted it from. You can save it to a different place on your desktop perhaps. But all you need to do now is just right click on this and say copy and that has now copied the MQL4 folder to your clipboard so we don't need that anymore and we're going to click off that as well so we now have that saved to our clipboard and the next thing we need to do now is to go and open our MT4 terminal and here we are inside our MT4 terminal and all we need to do now is head on up to the top level navigation, click on file, scroll down, click on open data folder. And this will open this window. Now, it's a very simple step that you need to do now, but very important. Take your pointer down to some white space below all the files. Please do not copy and paste your MQL4 folder inside this one here. What we're actually doing is we are merging, we are transferring, if you like, all the files that are inside our download that we extracted and they are going to be moved across here through the merge. So we don't want to copy and paste directly inside here. What we want to do is copy and paste it into white space here. So if we right click scroll down and select paste and here you'll see a pop-up that is asking you just to confirm that you want to merge this folder with the one that's already on your MT4 terminal and all you do is just click yes and that's it job done what's happened is that the files that we've extracted within the MQL4 folder in the download have now been transferred and copied into the MQL4 folder on your MT4 terminal. And the way to check that is just click on here and you'll find quantum referenced in three different places. First of all, at the bottom here in libraries, there we are. If you see this, that's great. Quantumlibrary.dll, that's terrific. That means your merge has gone correctly. Up into indicators, you will find this quantum folder. And if you click on it again, inside you'll see all the quantum indicators. Now it doesn't mean they're all enabled, of course. What it does mean is they've been downloaded 
And in the future, when you do buy another indicator, it will already be there on your download in your terminal. And finally, using the back button, we just go to this reference here under the include. And here again, you'll see two quantum references. So if you see all of those, that's terrific. Just click the back button. All done perfectly. Now, while we're here, let me show you one other thing that you need to do. Click on that again. And we go up to Files. Now in the files here, you will find this text document called Quantum, Quantum Enabler. This is part of the enablement process. All you need to do here is click on it and it'll be blank. Just type in or copy and paste your email address that you used to create your Quantum Trading account. It must be the same one because this is part of the enablement system. Please make sure there are no blanks. Just enter your email address here and when you've done, just click File and Save. I'm not going to put anything in here for the time being, but you will. That's it. File, Exit and Job Done. That's it. The only other thing you need to do now is to go up to Tools, go to Options. Under the Expert Advisors tab, make sure that this box here, which says Allow DLL Imports, is ticked. If it's like this and it's blank, then please just tick it and just click OK. And that's it. Job done. Now all you need to do is close your MT4 terminal. Just go to File, Exit. And then all we're going to do in the last video is just to drag and drop the indicators to the chart, which we'll do in the next video. So thanks for watching and see you shortly. And bye for now.